perform the duties of the office in which you are about to enter, so help you God. I do. Thank you. We must, as a united people, keep ablaze on this continent the flames of human liberty, of reason, of democracy, and of fair play as living things to be preserved for the better world that is to come. May the year 1940 be pointed to by our children as another period when democracy justified its existence as the best instrument of government yet devised by mankind. The President has deigned to offer me a handsome prize if I could tell him how to balance this budget in two years. The budget can be balanced under the leadership of a determined executive. The way to balance the budget is to stop spending government money, tear up the old budget, and begin at the beginning again. You boys certainly are going to have a good workout at this session of Congress. You better begin by supplying yourself with some asbestos film. Well, we hope to be there, Mr. The first President of the United States warned us against entangling foreign alliances. The present President of the United States subscribes to and follows that precept. The permanent security of America in the present crisis does not lie in armed force alone. What we face is a set of worldwide forces of disintegration, vicious, ruthless, destructive of all the moral, all the religious, and all the political standards which mankind after centuries of struggle has come to cherish most. 